All right. Yep, you guys aren't seeing things. I am running the Equinox today. Look at that with 11 inch coil. And uh, we're, uh, I put my Amphibio up for a few. I'm gonna run the uh, Equinox through this curb strip where we were yesterday. It's where I pulled them two silver rings and uh, Arthur Pol uh, Can You Dig It pulled the uh, bus token, the old tramway token. And I pulled a silver dime right there the other day. So we'll see what we can find with the Nox here. Let me get you guys with me on the first good target. Beep out. All right, my beeps. I got a uh, high tone on my Nox there. I um, mean, it was deep. I mean, down in there. So I just dropped it right here. Uh, somewhere here, and, uh, let's see if I can find it now. There it is, right here. It's a 9mm, <laughs> fired. Yeah, fired 9mm round. <laughs> 9 milli. All right, guys, I'll get you back with me on the next good target. Keep up. All right, my beeps. I got a uh, high tone on my Nox there. I um, mean, it was deep. I mean, down in there. So I just dropped it right here. Uh, somewhere here. And, uh... Let's see if I can find it now. There it is, right here. It's a 9mm, <laughs> fired. Yeah. Fired 9mm round. <laughs> 9 milli. Alright guys, I'll get you back with me on the next good target. Good job. All right, guys, so I'm back in the curb strip of the old church where they're doing all this construction over there, but the people said they didn't mind if we dug in this curb strip, which really it isn't theirs, but they take care of it. So uh, the other day, Can You Dig It and I were right here, and we dug out some old coins. Um, he got his first silver right here, a Merc dime, and then he also dug a... Uh, v nickel. Um, so today I'm back and I'm gonna see what I can pop out of here, man. And if anybody notices anything different, well, I'll just go ahead and tell you. <laughs> I'm running the knocks today. So um, I'm running the knocks out here because I ran the amphibio and the. Uh, can you dig it ran the simplex here so I wanted to bring the knocks out today and see if we can spank anything else out of here so I'll get you guys back with me on the first good target beep out all right guys so I'm back at the old church here and I had a real iffy signal and as you know today I'm running the knocks had a real iffy signal it was pretty deep uh, my whole pinpointer is in there so um, I had a pretty, it was iffy, and I dug this up, it's another Indian, guys, look at that, it's a little Indian, woohoo, get the beep out, let me see if I can see the date on it, uh, oh, 1893, guys, 1893, oh, get the beep out of here, it's in good shape too, huh? Oh man, look at that, guys. It's freaking beautiful. And that sucker was deep. Deep. All right, guys, I'll get you back with me on the next good target. Beep out. All right, my beeps. I just had a 
signal here and it was shallow. It's a quarter signal and it was shallow, but this is where all them old coins are, so I dug it anyway. And it is a modern quarter. But it's clad and we'll take it. Alright, see you guys back with me in the next good target. Alright, my uh, beep, so I just got a signal here, it wasn't very deep. On the knocks and uh you see it right there. I don't know if it's old. No, it's not old. It's the cars one. It's a little truck. It's uh, what's his name? Mater? <laughs> I think that's Mater. <laughs> yep. <laughs> it's not an old one, but anyway, I thought I'd get you guys on here for it. All right. See you on the next good target. All right, guys. So I just had a penny signal here. It wasn't as deep as all the 1800s coins in the night, early 19s. It was only about four inches, I guess, five. Um, but I see a green penny there, so I turned it on for you guys to see if we can see what it is. Uh, oh, it's another Indian. No way. It is another Indian. Holy Toledo. Oh, I can't read the date on it yet. Let's see. Oh my freaking gosh. I can't believe it was only five or six inches deep. No way. No way. It says 1897. What was the other one? Hold on. Hold on a minute, dude. Uh, here's the other one. This one's 1893. And this one is 1897. Or eight, yeah, 1897. Oh my god, you guys. And then the 1893 one isn't pristine. Look at that. Two little Indians. <laughs> All right, guys. Gotta love that shoe. I love that. Get the beep out, man. Look at that. All right, I'll get you guys back with me on the next good target. There's not a lot of targets, but the ones there are are freaking pretty good, man. All right, two little Indians. I'll see you guys on the next good target. All right, all my buddies out there in metal detecting land, we are doing the wrap up. Um, it was an awesome day of metal detecting. Uh, thanks for watching. Um, you know that old church and them curb strip, boy, they're on fire. I mean, we didn't find silver today, but I got two little wee Indians and four Wheaties, and it was a great day. Even a bad day of hunting when I find nothing's better than. Uh, a good day at work right so anyway um i want to do this wrap up with you here so here's our quarters clad uh we got a lot of dimes as usual uh, i only got three nickels today that's kind of odd um those are all copper pennies and those are four wheaties and they're off the 40s and 50s um there's an old older key. There's the nine millimeter bullet, and there's Mater. He's here. I haven't cleaned him yet. He looks really junky, but he's cool. All right, and this little thing I just found as I was—it's garbage. It's nine uh, crap two five, like Plug says. Um, but here is the best find of the day. All right, let me fix them up so you guys can see them. Two little Indians. And one of them is 1893, and the other one is 1897. And they're both in pretty good shape, man, for uh, being dug. So I was pretty happy to get that. I mean, they're awesome. I love old coins like that, so... You know, it was a great day. Um, 
I use the Equinox today. I'm probably going to be using it a little bit more because I've pounded the, some of these areas with the other machines. And uh, that's how I am. I try to use all the machines if I can. <laughs> um, but anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Um, thank you so much for helping me get to 100 subscribers. That was awesome. I really appreciate all of you. Um, at 200, I will be doing a nice giveaway. Um, like I said, I haven't thought it all out yet, but I'll have it ready. And I do have stickers coming in. They should be here probably Monday or Tuesday from Park Rat Pat. Uh, so we think my hat's off to him. We want to thank him for helping us make them stickers. And um, I hope you guys have a good weekend. Keep hunting. Stay safe. We'll see you on the next video. Keep out. Mm -hmm.